Hey, you're muted. You have to change your microphone. Click your lower left mute button because you are muted. Now I'm good. There you go. Oh, man. Uh, did you do it today? Yeah. Can you see my face? A little bit. See your eyes. Okay. Um, I mean, you you just brought it into focus, everything. Like you took your character, what I've seen you in, in moments, and you just like really put it out there in a whole like mature performance like it's it's complete you know it's all there you're you're going on all eight cylinders you know it's awesome <laughs> i don't know you know I, i'm not sure i have anything like other than just like wow to say it's uh you're saying things that aren't easy to say in a self-effacing way, but it's, you're not putting yourself down, but, and you're engaging people and challenging them, but you're not angry. So you're not scary, crazy, you're just crazy, but just enough, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if this is helpful, I, I mean, I'm just, Hey, like, you're you're my first feedback, and this is the this again. It was kind of like aimed at going, okay, March twenty first, and it's coming. And what was happening for me is going, okay, well, what is the first move? I got all of these things. I had all these big things, and the secret plan to cap sweep is always in the background, but it's not the foreground. If I lead with that, you know, no one will take me seriously. But I got all this other stuff. But if they see my cap, it's sweet, like, like <laughs> what would you? But I got this remedy. I got a software that'll be good for people. I'll ask it, you know. But the time translator is the beginning, and the connection to free space is maybe through the time translator. So, what is the first move becomes this constant look at all my moves, look at all my sequencing, look at everything I've done, and go, well, okay, well, there's some other person, one other person on the planet is going. Okay, Cap Sweet's about to make a move. I mean, that in itself is, you know, a miracle. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I'm yeah, and that's <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> no words, my friend. It just I just am grateful and I love it. I got goose pimples. <laughs> Chicken skin or whatever. Yeah, it's awesome. The performance is great. Um, you're you're um I think the length is fine. You could make fine little, like shorter moments and fine, you know, we, th there's things you can do with it. I don't think it needs much editing at all or really it's, what is it like uh, 18 minutes? I'm just guessing. Yeah. But the, I have no idea. The thing yeah. is I could take that and then I can add in like the seven steps. I can structure it. I can then, added all the, the layers of kind of like um piece of the puzzle yeah. right? and so well exactly but you you're breaking that fourth wall the, the same way marta is doing it with the writing the way you engage your audience and the subject matter and just the flash the background you got going the whole thing is super interesting I see how it, it all gels, you know, I mean, I'm seeing the, yeah, so, so how do you, yeah, so what's next? It's, it's like, well, a, well, what's next is we still have to sort of tune you into the, how to build the website and start to, you know, if we're, if we're launching tomorrow, two maniacs go, okay, yeah, we're launching it. Yeah, uh, exactly. Then it, it's kind of like, I put some more work into my move. I, I was kind of like, I had this seven step process and you know, I'm just putting these things in and so many, many of the things when I put together, it's like, ah, fuck, no one will see it kind of thing. So it's, it's, 
but each kind of like I go, okay, I got to move. Okay, well, then I could break it into seven steps. And then you know, I have got the seven steps. And each step is a video. And then this can happen. And then this can happen. And the, the video I sent you is going, well, maybe that's the Christian. Because for me, the web TV show, The Secret Plan, the other characters I'm involved with, um, you know, I have within my whole sort of information system, there's the inflow matrix, in the personal space. There's a new paradigm toolkit in the 101 space. There's a school of conscious communication in the group space. And there's planetary guardians in the community space. And in the center place, the sacred space, is there's only one of the very secret plan, like the actual story of how we're going to transform the world's economic system. And then I meet another guy who goes, well, I got a plan too, 4D free space about doing the same thing. Yeah. And... You know, I just really haven't met someone else who said, well, I got a plan. <laughs> anyway, yeah. It's going to change the whole species. Like you, you have to have yeah. a certain level of insanity to meet at that <laughs> point of going, oh, I as an individual who most, you know, <laughs> can't tie my shoes, but I can change the, the direction yeah. of the species. <laughs> yeah, you can say that with a certain with a certain uh, certainty in a humble way, because you have a certain vision that is that, you know, it's real for you. So you're able to do that with, I'm just saying the, that it, it holds truth because you're holding that space for it to happen. Well, well in, in, and let's say what you have is, let's say in essence, to me, free space is almost like a journey into the ideal, a journey into what we could create. And I'm right. always, this whole plan idea is always sitting in a coffee shop mapping the ideal going this isn't right i don't like this i want to create something new but i can't so yeah. I'm just sit here and dream about it i'm with you and that's more important to me than real life because i don't like real life as it is you know something's wrong here we, we well you're making a real life what any artist is, does is say this is my work whatever it is and i want you to enter and accept and you know dig my my reality whatever it is it could be jewelry making it could be something a chef does you know it doesn't matter what it is it's just you're putting when you're in that timeless place in yourself and that freedom it's all about freedom right you're you've got something to share free space is supposed to provide and that's why that post with galeo that you piped in on and that that's a critical post right there for the reasons that I wrote. Because it's a that's a work in progress and it's this is about conflict resolution. You're not going to have any of those visions unless there's a, a. A method. And a process, a procedure going on that's got mutual respect in it. So it's like, what an opportunity that post ended up being, you know, like in a way meant to be kind of thing, you know, it was meant to be that you stepped in and all of this is linked. I think we actually have a trail. This performance of yours is, a, is an actual piece of content that the, I think is that brings people into the game. There's a big game and there's the secret plan and you don't know what is what and you have you're bringing us through this journey and we have a reaction to your performance and we have a reaction to that post. It's like if we create a trail and give people an opportunity to react, respond to it, whatever that's going to be in the interest of conflict resolution in communication. We, we've got a lot of, I hope I'm being clear, we've got a lot of work under our belts here that people can um, find their own identity in. They're not, yeah. you, you want people to participate, they only participate, you don't want them to be just an audience, that's what you're saying. Yeah. But they're only going to participate if they have room to, for their own identity find their own identity in this. This isn't Captain Sweep's identity that they're living by. 
Yeah. The, it's their own, but they're inspired by what Captain Sweep has to say. You're, 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 you're willing to go out there and make a fool of yourself in a way. <laughs> oh, no, no, I didn't mean that. I went too far. Uh, um, oh, no, no. You know, that whole thing is very honest and um, naked in, in a way that you create, you become a reliable narrator for me. And it's not just because I'm way into the subject matter, that performance for me engages me as a, a follower, a listener, a reader, engages me to want to participate because you're giving me all these opportunities to participate. And now I want to know how I can actually do that. And then you like you cover it in the big grand way. And now I want to, okay, so let me get involved and sink my teeth into this. Let me let me try this out. What is he talking about? And then that's where free space comes in as a, a set of moves on a board that is a game inside a game. And, a, you know, we can lay it all out. And there's a, a round table to, I don't even know how to talk about it all, but it's all there. I know it's all there. So your reliable narrator that you, I think, is what you achieved with this performance, which is, I haven't seen, I've seen you, I knew you had it in you, but I never saw you actually pull it off like you just did. <laughs> wow, <Well>, thank you. <laughs> I'm, I've talked out, but I hope I got the, got it across. It, it, no, I'm, it's very inspiring. It, it, it happened, you know, and, and yeah, this gives us what we need for tomorrow because you set a tone also. The product really is communication, you know. I've got a brand of communication called Stay Timeless. Well, how is it that being timeless or what is it that is being timeless and how does that help us become better communicators, basically? And then it's got to be that simple. And then you got all you got something for everyone, basically. Well, so I'm going to – yeah, go ahead. Go. Keep going. I'm going to go to C, for instance, because she's and I'm going to explain to her how her being aggressive like she was and I feel out of line, how it gave us an opportunity for us, she and I, to go back and make it right with Michael and create a safe, free space for him to continue to share he's been at this as long as we have and and instead of me just getting pissed off at sea for one last time because she's been on probation with me for a while i had to see what the opportunity was that she's actually created for us you know in a way it's it's it, it's that's a really great post because the nature of it has something to do with nature, the post itself. And then the comments get really personal in a way. And I think that conflict is really important for us that we show how we can have a breakthrough with communication, with self-respect and mutual respect and all of that that's where it becomes something significant and not just a bunch of crazy artists doing this novel stuff, you know? No, I, I, uh, I get it. Like it, I that I was wondering, but it's hard like to participate. Let's say something like Facebook and see a thousand conversations yeah. and scroll like we do. And there's just so much info and just stop at one and go, no, yeah. this is the one that we need to focus on. <laughs> and and kind of like just stop that chipmunk in a in a wheel this is just yeah no but i gotta get to the next and this is how yeah. no I mean, this is the one stop. here it is stop here it is here it is we didn't and i said that i i sorry I, i've said that before on others and said this is the one but i didn't understand what that meant and this is the one because there's that conflict in it yeah and and moving forward we still have to resolve it but by showing it and sharing that level, to me, it's as real as your performance here tonight, you know? Like it shows a certain 
authenticity and that's what uh, you know that's what we're that's what there's a demand for out there you know well i think and you got you got the art levels down with all the stuff going on with the background you're looking at, i've talked to you about that all you've got like you don't need any help with that that's you got that down and um feeding you images here and there and you doing your own thing with it like you that it just that you you delivered tonight in a just big big way i i, I mean i i know i'm repeating myself but dude i i'm just totally my hat's off <laughs> i know how hard it is to do what you just did you know i'm a writer i'm a behind the scenes person and with the photograph with the stills and images and stuff but you just put it all out there and and just like created a an opportunity for for folks to you didn't make it about you you made it about the secret plan <laughs> you didn't make you're not like tripping out on on you it's all about the secret plan <laughs> it's just awesome <laughs> what can i say so tomorrow when we hit it let's just let that be the i got the lighthouse thing to go on um, you know to set the pace the, the, we'll and I, we'll just see what comes through for us tomorrow and we'll just put it set it up and then have invite specific readers to come yeah so and and and, and each person's got to have to add something to the conversation either written in there or we give them a space to add, you know it, it, you got to grow it like that well what about like it sort of makes sense i don't know if we can do this but if if you me sia and michael could go into a zoom call mm. that to me would be you know the place to mm. actually resolve the conflict and kind of be the next step if we were looking mm. at steps i like and, it and then from there you know, we could place, you know, all these bits and pieces into the move. And then that's the start of going, okay, like we could, you know, put the website up and have the jump link. I like it. Right? And that's because, I, you know, what I was thinking, because I, I, I haven't been good with deadlines and I've, <coughs> I've never really been given a sort of like, you're going to launch, you know, March 21st with your work kind of thing. And I have been, you know, doing quite a lot of work in the background yeah because of that and kind of thinking things through making videos doing this yeah. and attempting to get my ship in order in a sense to get ready for it but i realize it oh man i mean i could spend the next 30 years getting ready for this with all the stuff that i have and still not be ready and you got to start sometime and just kind of get into the groove of okay we're actually public now and i think for me it's just been a lot of fear a lot of you know kind of like putting stuff out but when I put it out, I know it's not going to be seen, so I don't really have to worry about it. <coughs> yeah, it's actually, I mean, something out where you think somebody's actually going to watch it. I, I I love you for your honesty, man. You just take such a leadership role in 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 the way you are. It's just a oh man, honest to God, I'm next to tears listening to you because <laughs> you just I, I don't mean to make an awkward moment, but I just have to put that out there because you just really show up in such an authentic way that um yeah no i'm i i appreciate you i very much do uh yeah man so i'm with you let's just do it that way okay. whenever you want um i'm going uh, my girlfriend and i have a are taking a ride tomorrow um because it's her day off and it's been a rough week and um but so whenever you it's good for you it can be this time tomorrow night or it can be earlier or it can be in the you probably are up all night and then sleep late kind of thing right well it depends but i i think it's more if we really if we want to take this to the next step like we said it makes you know hopefully we can get michael and see in here with with me and you and go through it and do it and that'll that sets the, that that's it. It's kind of like I, I I really agree with you in terms of it, there has to be a, a resolution of conflict. <clears throat> there has to be a way to include people rather than reject them. 
And if at the very beginning we're, you know, we're already losing the, a person who's paying attention, it's kind of like something's a little off here. Kind of, we need to. We, we got to go right start, to it. Yeah. So, so that's where you think we should be tomorrow. Well, I mean, I was. Yeah, I, I, I got to have a heart. I think I have to have a heart to heart with C because she's the first one to break down and go into drama. And I feel like I got to approach her as a writer to see the opportunity here and for her to participate. And this is the moment she's not being given an assignment. And if she has a problem with being given an assignment to resolve with Galileo, then it's she's really not on the team she's just pretending she is i i no? don't i i don't know enough about you and her and i don't but i i i don't well i'm talking I, about the issue i i the do issue. get the but the, the the thing about the issue is there's this bigger thing it's like we're not just going to resolve an issue we're going on to a stage to resolve an issue which at some point might have let's say millions or or the world watching yeah. Yeah, and that's not to say that it will happen, but if we don't take it that way, we're not understanding exactly really what we're exactly. doing. You got to respect the potential and you got to respect uh, plan for success. So, I mean, both you and I have the ability to sort of hold an idea that maybe no one understands. Yes. Have it to be true and sort of wait for people and circumstances to come around the idea to actually implement it. Most yeah. people, right? Th there's no belief well put. faith that that is going to happen. While me well are, are standing there waiting with the green circle going, okay, well, where's the stadium coming around us kind of thing. <laughs> but I don't know about you, but I go in and out of it. I go, you know, there's moments I'm in it and then other moments I'm depressed and I can't, you know, of course, lift the thumb because I don't think it will occur. And that kind of state change for the artist between, you know, I'm doing it versus I can't do it. I'm doing it versus I can't is that jump between free space and kind of like normal time, I guess. Yeah, man. So, so what should I do then? I guess I reach out to, I think you organize the meeting. You're the main okay. organizer here. Invite okay. Michael and Sia to have a chat with me and you and don't just like, let's say put them on the spot to be okay. we got to resolve this conflict with you say, a great opportunity has happened here. All these synchronistic events yeah. are coming to, to have this conversation and it is stimulated by this conflict we have, but there's something bigger, I think, that can come out of it. Are you willing mm -hmm. to go into a conversation with the four of us and see what happens? And maybe, yes. and maybe if we go, okay, well, why don't we let Elijah to be the facilitator kind of thing? And then I can actually bring in the remedy oracle and go, look, I want to try this out and just see if this can help us. We're, beautiful we're going to do beautiful. something different because as a conflict resolution if i've seen something it's like we got to take the agendas away take away you know these these biases and and come in with a new way of, of working through what we all misinterpreted probably at some point so why not just yeah. use divination to bring in a new one and if it works you know we, we may have a new way for our species to resolve conflict yeah i'm on it I'm on it. I'm on it. Okay. So it's not too late. I'll reach out to her tonight. And um, Michael goes to bed early. So um, I will think I'll just message him and ask him if I can call him tomorrow. And we could chat for five minutes. And And I think that's a way to do it. And then... I'll message you to tell you what I'm, how far I got. Okay. Okay. He's up early and he's in bed early. Okay. And it's weekend. So he's upstate and is uh, up New York in his new, uh, the house he's building <laughs> up there in the woods. So, okay. Wowza. Dude, Ed, thank you. Listen, to, uh, respect, respect. I'm just, um, I, I wouldn't have known how to invent it, but I see, I know what it is that I see, you know, I can tell you that I could, I didn't know enough to say, Hey, you got to go out there and say all these things. You knew that within yourself, but I can tell you that by watching it, you did it. You, you like you were fully committed and, and I learned all kinds of stuff I didn't know. And you're the storyteller that we need here to, um, 
to move this thing. Um, the second film, I, I'm going to come out with a, a film this year, a, a feature film I told you about uh, that I shot it in the 90s in the East Village. It's an East Village Western. I might have not have told you about it. But it's about a black cowboy that I met. And it's, it's um, he, in a way, is a character like you that's really out there. And he was able to say some things that I could never say. But I was very good at directing him and writing with him. And I see you and I in the same relationship, but not, but it's originating online with this Facebook and with this Zoom and with this virtual world, you know? Whereas in the 90s, it, he and I were just, it was a different, you know, the technology didn't exist. But you, just in terms of characters, you're very much like Philip and with the style and you're an original. So um, I can get behind you in a way as we build, you know, trust and mutual respect. It, 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 we can push each other's, the quality of each other's work, that's what I'm trying to say, which is the experience I had with him. Mm. It took, it's taken me 25 years to come up with to be a good enough artist to basically to fulfill, like his acting is so superb. It's shot like a documentary, but he's, it's all acted. And his acting fools you until you find out in the credits that the whole thing was acted and you're sure it was a documentary basically. Wow. Yeah. So, uh, you know, anyway, so my point is it's taken me all this time to find a way to speak to the audience, which is what Marta again is doing and you're doing. And I've struggled with that. So I can see it when someone else can do it. And I want to, I got some tools to help you push that, you know, just encourage you and stuff. Cause you obviously don't need much of anything. You're there, you know? Well, in encouragement when you're, I guess, speaking to an empty audience and you have no idea really <laughs> how you're going to receive yeah, having one person who goes, no, no, it's good. Just keep going rather than. <laughs> so I've got like, I would say offhand, like 50 people that I feel will step in that most of them I shared desperate with when I made a, that's the name of that film, that I made a version of it a few years, several years back and shared it with some friends on Facebook and they wrote a lot about it. I think uh, those same people and a lot more that I've met can recently can enter this this curated uh, sequence of uh, content, the video and the writing and everything we're putting out and can just give their experience of it, their review of it, their response and build it that way and that trail just starts beginning and, and we just keep getting, by us selecting the first audience, the it'll grow on its own, I think, you know what I mean? Well, the there's, story. A, there's a piece, that, there's, there's a lot of pieces which I haven't told you, which are sort of, uh, we're primed, man. I mean, there's a, there, you have no idea the amount of momentum behind the secret plan in terms of design. And so the actual move, I think, is getting like a process to get eight people together with this with the facilitator storyteller in a zoom call with the remedy program to answer questions and to create mastermind teams Every, so i've got like the first week is the people from free space basically you and your people and then i go through I, I created teams of eight of all these people that i know kind of like you that are all like super right People right haven't really right. come together and i'm just going to pop them together invite them create a schedule for the year and have this you know once a week great conversation with eight people using the tool and that's going to fuel everything like it's awesome i love it, like it i love it like the first you, you, move is gonna is just gonna like got you i'm blown away i love it
<laughs> so it's kind of like you know the honor of having the first move and the and, and the honor of sort of like being seen and the honor of going someone actually thinks what i'm doing has some significance it's like you want to bring as much to it as you can right you want to bring as much potency and there's a there's a lot to bear when you got a lot of different tools right you can you know it's like there's there like never before as an artist had let's say the ability to make video on his own to do the graphic design on their own to edit to build a website to like all of these things which i'd learned over the years because i had to now all together to create a whole new medium of expression right like where you put them all together and then invite and, all the other artists and go come on like we're we're, we're, in, we're in a renaissance of creativity here and and thank and i'm and i'm happy that you you're hip to what I'm talking about, about creating a traveling installation that has a, that has this a big screen as a, you know, a theatrical release element to it and has a, an actual installation, interactive thing going on and that it's something that we bring what you're doing here into the room, but not, but, but, you know, you get what I'm saying. It's like a, best a group party, show. Best party in the world. <laughs> yeah. That's where I'm, where I'm thinking. So, and, and framing it that way, there's money we can, that's my angle for how we're monetizing this. <laughs> Considering we're going to build a new economic system at some point, I don't think money's going to be a problem, but, uh, <laughs> I, I do, you know, I think it's going to be this kind of like yellow brick road is going to open up in front of us. There, there's just going to be so much opportunity because we have a solution, a real solution that's right. so sort of uh, unthought of. But exactly, really, I think Buckminster Fuller <laughs> probably, you know, there's we're standing on the shoulders of giants who've done all the yeah a lot of hard work, you know, to get us. That's, to that's that's why I love that question of what would Fuller do with the tools we have now. It encompasses everything you just said and it takes it, it, it builds a base right there of science artist, thinker, a man who created a game, a world, the world game, you know, who was doing exactly what we're attempting to do now and what would he do with the tools we have now? That's the only frame we need right there. I mean, that's a totally legitimate novel approach to this that makes just got you know makes good sense uh, yeah so i got a lot of writing to share with you too design stuff but i love what you're talking about there you're making it road ready in a way so we start with the uh with the zoom call and i'll i'll reach out to see tonight and and and, and galileo in the morning Okay. Okay. Great to anything, uh, chat. anything else? Yeah. Just it, just I a mean, lot of appreciation for the uh, I guess for both of us having the allowance to allow the miracles to occur without getting in the way. <laughs> God bless you. Man. Yeah. I've had exactly. some beautiful moments in the, uh, without yeah. getting in the way. <laughs> like it, it is there and I, you know we could stomp on it but it's kind of like not this time. No, let's, let's, you know, not this time. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. I appreciate you so much. I'll, I'll, uh, what time is it out there now? Eight, Just so I, eight sixteen. Okay. So it's probably 11, 16 here. Yeah. Okay. So when it's noon here, it's, uh, it's nine o'clock at your place. I got you now. So should I check in with you around noon? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll, I'll be around all day. So. Okay. All right, brother. Good night. I, 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 I don't even want to end it. There's just so much, but I, I think it's a good idea. Okay. I'm, I'm, I, I, I'm not usually overwhelmed by people, but th this session has taken me to the brink of my limits of <laughs> what I'm able to absorb. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Okay. I'll leave you. I'll leave you with that. <laughs>